हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू आर फिट एंड फाइन एट यूर होम बी एट होम एंड बी सेफ ओके सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू टीच यू वन ऑफ द चैप्टर्स ऑफ जियोग्राफी दैट इज द फर्स्ट चैप्टर द अर्थ एंड ग्रेटिक्यूल बिफोर मूविंग फॉरवर्ड टू अंडरस्टैंड वॉट इज ग्रेटिक्यूल आई वुड लाइक टू आस्क अ सिंपल क्वेश्चन टू यू ओके आर यू रेडी फॉर दैट ओके वेरी गुड See listen carefully can you tell me where is your school located where is your school located think over it and try to answer the question take your time and answer the question yes see student answer to this questions may be varies from student to student why because the student will consider his own location while giving answer to this question because of that we can see difference in answers for example the students can answer the school is to the east of my house the school is to the west of my house the school is to the northeast side of my house in this way the answers can be different okay what do we understand from it yes can you guess yes it means that only directions will not work to locate the actual location of a place okay for that purpose we require some much more information so that we require an advanced the method of determining the location okay before moving forward again i would like to show you a map observe the map carefully then we will move forward okay student are you ready so watch the map hello students watch the map carefully what do you see in this map yes different places we can see as well as some of the boys and girls belong to different places what they are doing here they try to answer the question they try to tell the location of taj mahal okay you also observe it carefully and try to give the answers of questions let's see the questions which places are shown on the map in which city is the taj mahal located in which continent is the taj mahal located in which direction is the taj mahal located for graham in st petersburg for kataya in kimberley for michiko in tokyo and minakshi in port blair Shahid in Agra is specifying the direction in which the others live how will he express them in what directions will natalia in rome and enrique in lima say the other child lives will their answers be the same graham katia michiko natalia minakshi shahid and enrique have answered the above questions differently using directions and sub directions the taj mahal is located at one and the same place and that is agra however when each one of the children told the direction from their respective places their answers were different this means that the use of directions alone does not help us to accurately describe the location of a place that is why it became necessary to find a new system to state the precise location of any place on the earth let us see what it is students observe this figure carefully it shows the lengths of east west and north south diameters of the earth through this we can understand about the size of the earth the 
east west diameter is 12756 kilometers and north south diameter is 12714 kilometers it is impossible to actually draw lines on the earth due to the oceanic waters uneven nature of land forests innumerable islands of different size and buildings geographers overcome this difficulty by developing a miniature model of the earth in the form of a globe this miniature model can be used to determine locations on the earth now lines can be drawn actually on this horizontally and vertically though not on the earth thus they are imaginary lines on the earth which help us to determine location students now we are going to study an angular distance what do you mean by angular distance and how do we measure an angular distance an angular distance help us to determine the location then how to find out the angular distance the location of any place on the earth is determined with reference to the center of the earth in order to find it out we need to consider a straight line that joins the point on the surface and the center of the earth let's see with an example here a line has drawn from point of the surface of the earth that is x and it has joined the center of the earth at equatorial plane that is m here at this point it makes an angle with the plane of the equator that is x m v the measure of this angle will be used to determine the location for example the measure of an angle x m v is 30 degree that is its angular distance from the equator is 30 degree have you understood students how does angular distance measure i how does it help to determine the location of any place at the surface of earth okay now observe the figure again see in the figure one more plane passes through x point and this plane is parallel to the equatorial plane it forms a circle on the surface any point on the circle and the equatorial plane form an angle of 30 degree at the center of the earth okay student have you understood okay very good students now look at the figure and tell the angular distance of y from the equator okay observe the diagram carefully and try to give the answer okay very good thank you Yes student have you understood now what are the imaginary lines on the globe okay that help us to locate a place okay as well as you might have understood what is the angular distance and because of the angular distance we can locate the place on the surface of the earth okay very good